No, that's not the. That's not. This Wee! Is, this is uh, what you call it. This is progress. Oh, is this progress? The secret door was not progress. Damn it, I forgot. <laughs> well, we'll have time later. There might not be a cutscene. Maybe I can just talk about it. No, back it's a cutscene. Darn. Oh, well, I tried my best. Remember? Because we saw this earlier uh, in the demo. Oh, we saw the back half of this cutscene. This is You're right. real. You're right. In the, de in the demo. Yeah, I forgot. I'm such a fool! Oh, hey, look, there's Amy. Why is she here? Oh, she got grabbed by the robot, remember? We were chasing her. Oh, yeah. Wow! Oh, look, the arm came out again, but did you see that it's way above yes. where it... Like, you could literally see that it extended out behind He's the... chucking this bird. Oh, wait, what? A Chaos Emerald? How did it fit in that thing when the Chaos Emerald is bigger than it? Be gone, all of you! This is all I really need. Uh, the Be big, gone! You, you could literally Boss. see the little crank arm was reaching, yes. was extending farther back than the position where it would have come up out of his little hovercraft. Oh, hey, by the way, this is our first, this is actually the first time we get to see him. Well, if Gamma. we played the other campaigns, we might have seen him first. Yeah, but, but we're doing this the right way. Indeed, the right way. The the way that it was intended. Get rid of these pets! Show them what you've got! Aye, aye, sir. Yeah, that's the voice I remember. I don't understand why they keep changing Omega, not this guy, but Omega's voice. Oh, dude, it's, it's really it's, confusing. Gamma, yeah, no. Gamma's voice and Omega's voice, the first iterations were the best. And then every other time- All oh, right, they... boss fight. I was reaching for my glass of water. Oh, uh, whoa! No! Whoa! I need, a, I need a ring! Boss fight! Another tough one, just like Knuckles! Does he say, oh no? No, he just makes boy 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 noises. And you do. Oh, what are you gonna do about me now, bitch? I got all these energy. I'm so powerful, I create my own speed lines of energy Whoa. whipping around my body. And burp. Beep, burp, 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 burp. I am, I am. Did you know that during the shootout in uh, the, the Tech Noir uh, in the original Terminator, for one like frame, when Kyle Reese hits the Terminator with a shotgun in the arm, there's one frame in that fight scene where you can see a tiny little blue spark of electricity on his shoulder, and it's one of the first hints that he's a robot, other than the fact that obviously he's taking 12 shotgun shells to the face, but yes. it's it's like the first real hint of his true nature. So what you're telling me is underneath all that metal, this is actually Arnold Schwarzenegger. Absolutely, yes. That's why he's such a good actor. You must have your reasons. <laughs> you must have your reasons. Sorry, I can't... I, I didn't even realize they were talking over I'm sorry, me, like, what, Amy? Did you say something? This robot is my friend, Tony. I'm oh. sorry, what, Amy? I couldn't, I didn't catch that. The ship is losing the altitude. The robot is my friend, Sonic. Don't hurt him. He's my friend. What, Amy? I'll find that big man and put him out of commission. It's <laughs> so quiet. <laughs> Why is Sonic so slow? He's the fastest thing alive, damn it. Now you can play as E-102. Why? Wait a minute. No, that's not why. I was just a stupid kid who didn't know what Gamma was. Now oh, you can chat with him. No, Sonic. Sonic! No, Sonic! What's up, little buddy? Oh, Whoa. no! So I thought I mentioned it to you earlier, but it's like, this is the game that taught me what the word altitude meant. Oh, well, that was simple enough, I guess. Yeah. Sweet. He's fine. No harm, no foul. Yeah, that's what it is in uh, Sonic. He's in Sonic. Yeah, he's the one that's in Sonic Battle. It's not Omega. Captain's room. I don't know where that is. It's, is this the pool room or the captain's room? It told room? me to run the other direction, so my gamer yeah, instincts tell room. me to come here first. Yeah, there's an emblem in here somewhere. <clears throat> It's a very big pool for him, but it's a pretty nice one, honestly. Well, I don't know why, why would you not? Why would you there. not give yourself as big a pool as possible if you had the opportunity? I guess so. But why do you need all these lounge chairs? Like if I could have a pool of any size and like I didn't have to worry about upkeep because it was an indoor pool like yeah. this, it, I would I would absolutely go big or go home. But why do you? Why do you have so many things here? Like he isn't creating a lot of robot. Maybe maids he's to hang maybe out he's with. expecting once he rules the world he'll have a lot of guests. Like people will want to you know show up and be like, oh Eggman, please don't blow up our city. This is where he'll entertain dignitaries. When I guess he's, you so. Know, yeah. Pulling the world ransom for one million dollars. He just wants friends. That's all he actually wants. Just like Xehanort. Oh no! Wow. I sure I'm glad that if the I'm volume. If I continue, I need to change this ship back to its original shape. Okay. There must be a switch somewhere on the bridge. I've got to find it now. 
That is so right. di that is so different That's... from any other cutscene in the entire game. It's bizarre. Not only in that, like, the obviously all sound. Not that there aren't not that there aren't other cutscenes with no sound no, in this but... game. But specifically the 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 mechanical instruction, because normally this game does not care to explain no, what you're doing not. or it, what you need to do. Possibly to its detriment. Okay, before touching the switch, get beside it and start charging. I want to see if there's volumes on this or not. Yeah, say damage volumes. Told you. Damage volumes? Well, up for the the. Oh, you oh you just mean that like the 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 the. Not for you, but for enemies. Right. That you you mean that this puts out a hitbox. Yes. Yeah, I got it. Sorry, I'm stupid. No, 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 no. I got it. Cause I cause we talk about volumes a lot as well, and people are like, "What the hell are you talking about?" And I I I picked up different developer lingo from different places, so maybe I've been wrong about stuff. But I primarily like when I talk about because people get confused. I mainly mean like because hitboxes typically people think about like you know. An enemy, yes, right, or you know, a fighting game or whatever. But there's also just like like kill boxes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's more. That's what I usually refer to in like PC games more often, where it's like you walk into a space and the game just kills you outright. A kill plane, perhaps. You're jumping the gun, son. Whoa! I tried. Wow. Did you know if, if you use other buttons on the remote, you can do a spin dash while in that as well? I learned that as a child. It's bizarre that when you're in this, like, it slows you down when you're in this, and I can- What's the noise? It wasn't making that noise a second ago. I don't know what's happening, Joey. Well, he's not here. It's- where is it in this room? That's, that's such a weird chair. He's a big man. He is a big man, but He probably still. plugs his brain into that to- no! No, you did Release it. me! No, you did it. See, there's the No, stuff. I know. I'm aware. I was just like, it was, I couldn't get out of the way. Yeah, well... He probably, he probably sits in that and his brain gets plugged into the computer and he, and he issues orders unilaterally to all of his robots, like, at once, right? Oh, yeah, the monorail. You know, we were talking about Star Wars last episode and, like, on, like... There are so many parts of Star Wars that are just so unsalvageable. Because, <laughs> well, because, like, cause, like this, the prequels are, like, a mess, right? Yeah. And... All of the EU stuff, all of the books and the comics were just different authors attempting desperately to find some way to, like, salvage that storyline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And one of the biggest problems is, like, why should I care about the Clone Wars if it's a war between disposable clones and disposable robots, right? And so there were multiple different approaches taken. The Gendy Tartakovsky shorts, which you're, you know, you've seen some yes. of those. The choice there was make them the coolest. At least, the, you know, the special ops yeah. guys. Make them so cool you have to buy a toy of them. Also, it should be stated that you're like you don't. You're oh yeah, I'm not touching remote. the controller. I know, We've, but this has happened already multiple times in the game. Yes, but so just one. I, 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 ho I hope that again. at this point the audience will have been able to assume these things on their own about Hopefully. about the function of one this game. One can only hope. Wow. It really like it must assume that you only want to use the free camera for a few seconds at a time, and then it defaults back to auto. Yeah. Anyway, I'll just leave it here for Sonic to move off for a minute. But, and then like, uh, and then other stuff like the Republic Commando novels, uh, tried to treat them, like kind of take them seriously and treat them as, you know, big badasses. And yeah, yeah. The main character in the Republic Commando novels falls in love with a Jedi. And I shouldn't say he falls in love with, he and a Jedi fall in love. And he tries to save her during Order 66 on Coruscant and can't and watches her get gunned down in front of him because he can't get to her in time. Um, but like the problem is, and, and in the Clone Wars CG show was like, we have to, let's, okay, now the story, we're gonna focus a ton on these clones and the whole point is gonna be, man, wouldn't it, like what would act, what would it actually be like on like a psychological level if you were trying to make, trying to stand out as an individual in an army full of people who look just like you, <laughs> right? The problem is that as soon as you start writing them as real people, then it becomes, okay, then how can they, on a dime, turn around and blow Jedi away. How can yeah, they just yeah. turn around and shoot them in the back of the head, right? Because it's like in the movies, it's because they're they're just they're, they're just, soldiers who are programmed for perfect obedience, yep. right? But it's like okay, if that's not that's not a good story. No, <laughs> I can't care about that. So they get rid of that in the Clone Wars TV show, and and they um and they uh, they treat the characters as you know real people who have, can think for themselves, even if they do have in some cases somewhat limited education intentionally because they're just meant to be soldiers. Yes. But the main thing, and this is where I've said before that the Clone Wars TV show actually retcons the stuff from the films, uh -huh. just in a way that you like people will go, "What are you talking about, Jacob? It can fit in the films," but like. 
It really, it really, really doesn't. Um, basically, they say the Order 66 thing is, oh, they got a chip in their head. Yeah. They got a chip in their head, and when Palpatine hits a button, they'll blow the Jedi away. And that's, like, a, actually a major plot point in the later seasons is, like, is somebody, like, figures it out and tries to blow, you know, be a whistleblower. Um, but now it's like, okay, but that's, but that's not... Yeah, okay, fine. Now I can actually care about these characters, which is one of the greatest accomplishments of the Clone Wars TV show is that I hate Anakin in those movies. Except in the first one, he's okay and as a kid yeah, in The fine. Phantom Menace. But I really don't like, as much as, like, I, I think people give Hayden Christensen too much crap for his, like, acting performance. It's just that his lines, it's the script in those movies is so bad, there's no reason to care about the characters. But it's like, the Clone Wars TV show actually makes Anakin a re like a really likable, awesome character, and it makes the clones really likable and awesome, but the problem is that they still have to fit within the canon of the other bad movies. Yeah. So it's 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 like you can't you can't fix it. You can't pry the stupidity out of those movies, no matter how hard you Whoa, may try. There he is. We gotta go we gotta Well go. should I go back and investigate the, the secret chamber before we go and investigate this? <laughs> if you'd like to. We got more pressing matters to take care of. We'll I have to go through the secret egg, chamber. Well, what is, is this? This there. is this a level? No, it's the pool again. Well, Damn it! <laughs> right, I remember this wasn't up here before, but now it's back. Yeah, got, and also, got think it. about how bad this is. You don't see it right there, but well, actually, we might see it now. But it's like it spins, but it like, oh yeah, we didn't get to see it. So it spins out and it causes you to spin. It does. You, there's no spot in it that you can just stand where it wouldn't, and that would just that's just bad design, Eggman. Shame on you. Maybe he knows how fat he's getting, and so he's trying to be like a bulimic. He's trying all his oh, fall no. of his machines spin. Oh no, so the he'll... deepest lore. No! Oh, whoa! Oh no. So I don't get that. Whoa! Leave me alone. It's like I, I really Oh right, I, they change every time you screw it up. Yeah. My bad. So is it is it a washing pan that falls? What is, it's a Japanese thing I've seen. It's a gag thing I've seen in like like games and anime. Where it's like a washing pan falls on somebody's head or something. I'm not. A, I think it's a I'm washing not pan. An expert. I don't know. I am not an expert on Japanese. Whoa! Culture, what's this Julia, thing? Really say. This looks like some kind of weird VR chamber. This is. I don't. I don't know. It's orange. Oh, it's shaking. Wait, what's happening? This looks like the. Whoa. Um. Uh, this looks like the the. It looks like a much larger version of the VR pods from Titanfall. <laughs> oh gosh, it does, doesn't it? A little bit. Whoa! What? Another one. Another one. That's the third one. Someone release me from this Chow-themed prison. So why does Eggman have a Chow one? Oh no. This is, this is explicitly an Eggman one. I mean, he gets lonely. Maybe he has like a, like a dad complex or something. Well, the thing that's weird about this one is that it has a teleporter. Yeah. Which means that if I was in Station Square, I could hop on the teleporter to this one and then be on Eggman's secret base. Oh, but also if you see right there, it does not want you to. Not right now it doesn't, but later. But later. Though, honestly, this is not actually themed around the egg carrier. No. It's, it's themed around something that's going to happen later. Yeah, that that is absolutely... How do I get out of here? You just stand back up. I'm trying. There we go. Oh, Where's... man, that was a harsh cutoff. No fade. Nope. It didn't even have, like, the, the teleport line, or the teleport energy like the last one did. No. No time for that. <clears throat> but, yeah, that's that. That's the secret... Why did he put a password? I guess, like, why would he pa I password protect that? I don't know. Okay, There it goes. No. It's spinning now. Okay, he, so theory. So the reason is because it's like that's... He, he has to keep up a, a strong appearance, but it's like... But he cares for these chow. So he's got to make it a secret so nobody knows that he has a soft spot. If I had a room that needed a... That had a big, like, password keypad thing that was, like, easy to guess or even had the password sitting around nearby, that would mean that I had... Like like remote explosives inside the room, and it was a trap. Yeah, exactly. Just as a point of reference. Whoa! If you ever walk up to a big door with the, all the letters of my name, and you're like, oh, how do I open it? Don't go inside. Not again. Okay, and so to answer the question earlier of do we have a Chaos Emerald, the answer is no. Chaos. Could this be the same thing? <laughs> I didn't know you could see them in there. If you look closely, you can yeah, see Yeah, there's the little colors. The... They're all there. No, 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 but... Oh, you can see fr the froggy. Froggy? Froggy? Froggy! How many times have we referenced this character over the years and oh we've just said Froggy or used a stupid voice and people were like, what are they talking about? 
It's, 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 it's bizarre. It's bizarre, but we'll get into it once we get to get too that big. character. We'll get big into it when we get to big. You madman! I will! How did he know what the last form was called? Destroy them all! Immediately! Oh, there's only one of us. So this is Chaos 6. Yes. Okay, making sure I didn't have it wrong. So yeah, this is... Eggman! Whoa! Could've just killed my oh dancers with have been over. Uh oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! I I'm read about die. this online! <laughs> no, like I... I said before, no judgment if you're into it or whatever, as long as you're not hurting anybody. <laughs> Sonic says practice safe sex. Sonic says... And always sure to... get consent. Sonic says remember to pee after sex. Communication is an important part of any relationship. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Dude, it's just like the one of the final... It's just like the the um uh, the Braid fight like from Uncharted. Birth by Sleep. What do I hit? You're oh, it's a pink elephant on parade now. No, you are you have to listen for for Eggman to do his... And see, look, you see those things he's dropping? You Now, gamer logic says avoid it, but actually... I didn't get that one. But actually, you don't avoid it. Why? I don't know. Do I just throw him at him, or do I... No, you know, he you sucks like, them up, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And he gets... Whoa! So you can two-cycle this boss if you have the right knowledge, but you didn't, so you're gonna four-cycle. Well, I'm sorry, Joey. No, if you uh, if you do the light-speed attack, it does double damage. Oh, okay. Interesting. So you can three-cycle it now. Unless that's only with Knuckles' version. Spoilers, Knuckles has something similar to it. I'm, I'm literally not gonna waste my time trying to do the light-speed attack. <laughs> but it'll, it'll speed the fight up, actually. Because all you gotta do is you can just charge it up in a second. I don't believe that it will work. Nah, dude. Listen, you gotta believe in me, friend. Drop it, and then okay, just charge. I'll, I'll give it a shot. Just charge up. You can, you can store to charge for a while. I don't think you can, can you? You can, you absolutely can. Oh, dude, I, oh, look, I can kill those. Like yeah. you said, yeah. It totally puts out a big a big volume around me. Oh, it's no. like, nope, this is a hitbox. Yeah. This is, this is, a, this is uh -oh. damage volume. Did it delete them all? Yeah. Uh-oh, whoa. Oh, boy, whoa. I, I do love it when it whoa. does that. But yeah, no, when you're, uh, the light speed dash in this game, you can walk around Get up! With get, the get the charged. ring! Yeah! God. Oh yeah, charge it up. Yeah. Oh, or not hold now. On. Yeah, it's fine. Oh, I still hit, I heard him with the You hit. did. Okay. Well, like, literally, yeah, just charge it up, and you can... Whoa. Sorry, I, I had to get out of the way of the attack. Uh oh! Oh, Can't leave get me out of be! The way. Leave me be! Walk on by! Eggman, why yeah, would you give me these things to fight yeah, your your, your genetic up. monstrosity? Uh -oh. uh oh! Oh no! Looks like I soft locked the game. I'm gonna have to talk to that guy on YouTube that Joey was watching earlier. The soft locksmith. Soft, close soft lock picking. Soft yes. lock pit lock picking. Yeah! I gotta do it. I'm gonna beat the video game. Yeah, but we're not on world record pace anymore. Who cares? So once again, this game has no good boss fights. No, I can't believe this. I can't I believe, believe this. You hey, some other time. Ba, 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 ba. Amazing. Oh God. <laughs> How do we get off this rust bucket? <laughs> we can jump. That Sonic survived the plane crash earlier. Yeah. Why wouldn't he survive jumping off of this thing? It's probably over the ocean. I say that, Sonic doesn't like water. No way, I can't believe this. Sonic. <laughs> oh, hey. Hey, Knuckles. Hey, Knuckles. You're not blinged out yet. Hey there, Knuckles. Hey there, Knuckles. How's it going? I thought you got lost or something. Why would, you, why would he show up here? He can fly. But he can't. No, he, he can't. Go, uh, no, he cannot. I don't know how he got here. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> it looks so... I'm gonna get you, Eggman! Come back here! You just stopped. You saw that, right? You it's may be small. in a ship that can fly up and down, but I so can you fall. can literally just turn left or right and then go up, but I'm gonna catch you! Oh no, it didn't I'm, work! I'm tempting death again! <laughs> oh, my genius plan didn't work! I think that's supposed to be a comedy shot, but it's really bad. 
Where's this? Freaking Jimmy Neutron, the League of Villains episode. Jimmy gets up, all the villains team up to get Jimmy. They kidnap him. Sheen is the only person who manages to stow away to try and rescue him, and he breaks in to save Jimmy. And all he has is two bananas. As he put his finger, like, you know, yeah, guns. Yeah, yeah. And he has no plan. And and when Jim, when they're both locked up in prison, he goes, Ah, oh, man, I can't believe my plan didn't work. What plan? Oh, right. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> hey, wow! Overarching plot stuff. What's happening? That scene also has a great. That scene has another great Sheen Jimmy interaction. Sheen! Oh, please tell me you're not alone. Okay, I'm not alone. Where are the others? What? You just said you're not alone because you told me to. Now be quiet. I'm saving your life. <laughs> so wow, the tutorial thing is. Uh, the <laughs> play is big. big. The whole gang. The gang the is gang's all, all here. here. This is. God, this game has no idea what it's doing. What do you mean? I mean, let's recap the plot so far. Oh yeah. Okay. The, the mysterious so monster far. appears in town. Sonic chases it away. Rescues Get Tails. Get back here, you big drip. Rescues Tails, who has a Chaos Emerald and wants to use it in his new plane. Eggman steals the the emeralds, and it is established that they are being used to power a thing called Chaos. Sonic and Tails decide to acquire more Chaos Emeralds. They get they one from Windy it. Valley. They just do it. And somehow. one from the Casino Zone, and they lose both of them. Immediately to Eggman. Yeah, well, they lose one of them later to the to Knuckles. Yes. Um, they go but ultimately then, to Eggman. Yes, they go to the mountain uh, to get another Chaos Emerald. They then lose that to Eggman. <laughs> whereupon he arrives Boy, in his airship. This is reminding me of Borderlands 3's plot. He yeah. arrives in his airship. You haven't told me anything about Borderlands 3. That might have to be a discussion in a few oh minutes Lord. here. He arrives uh, in his airship and leaves with all the Chaos Emeralds. They get on Tails' plane, follow, get shot down. Sonic and Tails are split up. At this point, Sonic runs into Amy. Amy, Amy is chased by a robot <clears throat> and captured. Sonic pursues the robot to Mystic Ruins, where the robot is, is taken aboard Eggman's ship. Sonic pursues Eggman's ship. Tails arrives with a plane. They get on the plane to chase, chase Eggman's ship again. The only thing that's changed in the meantime is that Amy is now aboard the ship. This time they manage to land. Uh, they get there. They get to the bridge. Don't find Amy. Amy has escaped on her own, apparently. That's not actually what happened, but we'll see it during Amy's campaign. Uh, and then we fight Chaos again, and we jump off the ship after Eggman, uh, and now there's a temple. Yeah. But also the that the glowing myst like mystical ball that has been telling us the hints is like oh I gotta follow that. Stay tuned for the next exciting chapter of Sonic Adventure. Maybe perhaps something will happen. Oh, a lot has happened. Yeah. Better get going. 